Hello and happy Fitness Friday. Happy Fitness Friday, guys. We are so excited to be here with you this Friday to work out. We're gonna do the mini roller coaster workout with you this morning. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I am Dr. Ayla Donlin. And I'm Emily Sopo. We're your MyZone Master Trainers. We're very excited to be here with you every Friday live, 8 a.m. on the West Coast, 11 a.m. on the East Coast, all around the world, over in Europe and Asia. We know you're tuning in from everywhere, so thanks so much for being with us. Thank you guys so much. And as you are tuning in, give us a little hello. Let us know where you're tuning tuning in from. Yes. And if you're gonna work out with us, please do tell us because we wanna be able to cheer you on as we are getting our sweat on too. That's right. Hey, Coach B. Hey, Coach B. And make sure that you share this out so that your pals can be working out with you. And if you want, you can tag them by just tagging their name in the comments section so there's a lot of ways that you can involve your friends in this workout. Yes. Hi Gladys. Hi Natalie. 4 p.m. in the UK. Almost the weekend. Thank you for Ooh. that Natalie. Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Also guys, please do check out myzone.org where you can learn more about MyZone. You can explore the Master Trainer blog and you can find out more about MyZone all over social media including MyZone Moves on YouTube which is where we house all of our previous Fitness Friday broadcasts. So if you're yes. in need of some workout ideas, want to work out alongside us, check out those broadcasts on the YouTube channel. Yeah, there's a lot available because we've been doing these workouts now for over a month. Yeah. So you're going to have a nice library of workouts that you can do. And there are so many different ways that you can play around with the zone match feature that we're going to be playing with today. Hi, Sue. Hey, Sue. Thanks for joining us. Yeah. And she's going to work out with us. Good. Yes. As per usual, Sue's on it. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right, guys. So today's workout, like we said in the beginning, is the mini roller coaster. We're going to show you one round of this workout where we literally take you up through the zones and then come back down. But there are two and a half rounds if you're doing the 30 minute mini roller coaster so after we're done keep going we yes. want you to get in that full workout exactly hey Debbie this is the best workout ever I love my zone yes we're glad we do too awesome hi Camila hi oh so exciting cool so today is all lower body exercise. It is gonna be heart pumping. We will get all the way up into the red zone, uh, but we will be using primarily our lower body and we won't need any equipment other than yeah. we've got mats. So right. if you've got you know carpet or mats or whatever, we will do a couple exercises on the ground. Other than that, it's just body weight. Yeah. That's all you need. Which makes it very manageable. And Emily and I will be showing some modifications and progressions throughout. And we would always invite you to make the workout your own. So these are just suggestions. The beautiful part about zone match is what you're targeting is to hit the zone exactly spot on in terms of being in the appropriate color as we go through the workout. So you might choose exercises that work better for you to get into those zones. So th these, this is just a taste and example and we've made it easy for you by mapping it out. Yeah, should we do it? Let's do it. Okay, cool. So Ayla has got the uh, MyZone Zone Match app open on her phone. Make yep. sure that you have your MyZone app open. Go to the workout section and you'll see ZM under where your tile goes. You're gonna click ZM. It is a 30 minute workout and there's all the times they're listed at the bottom. Click on the 30 minutes, yep. scroll down, find mini roller coaster, and we're gonna press play all together. Yes, and you've probably noticed this, but you should have your belt on and activated. You'll hear one beep when your belt is activated. You need the belt to be on and activated in order to effectively load and press play on the zone match. So make yeah. sure you're ready to rock and roll because we're gonna hit play and go. Okay, you guys ready? Let's, Let's do, do it. This. Okay. Tell me when, girl. I'll okay. play. So, mini roller coaster. We are going to start out, just so you guys know, the first 30 seconds are gray, so you can kind of move however you want to move to get into your groove. And then we'll start after those 30 seconds with the exercises we've selected. So, let's begin in three, two, and one. Boom. On. Okay, 30 seconds in the gray zone. This is lower body, so maybe do some lower body stretches. Okay, let's stretch it out. Hamstrings. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna copy you with that one. It's a good one. Yeah, I really like this Ooh. one. It's good for the back, good for your hamstrings and your glutes. Yep. And keep in mind, guys, you can always do a warm up before this. In fact, you might even go through a five to ten minute warm up before any zone match class if you'd like to. All right. First exercise is on the ground. We're gonna take our hands back behind us, below our shoulders, and we're going into tabletop. So feet hip width apart. You'll lift your hips up, squeeze your glutes, and lower back down. And that's it. Good. So 30 seconds here. Make 
make sure that your shoulders are down away from your ears, that you're squeezing your glutes. This should feel like a nice stretch. How you doing, Ayla? I'm doing great. Good. It feels good, huh? Yeah, it does feel really good. Keep going, guys. I'm going to check the time. All right, next exercise, we are going to come onto our back. Feet parallel, hip width apart, hip bridges, single leg. So bring one leg up in the air. It can be straight, it can be bent. You're pressing through your bottom heel that's on the ground. Squeeze your glutes, lift up and down. Make sure that you inhale as you lower and exhale as you lift. Yes, Woo. and if single leg feels like a little bit too much, you can always put both feet on the floor and take it to a regular bridge. Yeah, let's switch sides. So we've selected exercises that should get us into our target zones for the zone match class. A few more seconds here. I'll let us know when we're going to switch. We're going to a side plank in three, two, and one. Go ahead and roll over onto your side. Place your elbow below your shoulders. You can always do this on your knees if you'd like to or on your feet for a little bit more of an advanced option. We're also going to add in a dip down and up with this. 30 seconds on one side and 30 seconds on the other. Whew. I'm going to choose an option where I'm up on my hand instead of on my elbow and it'll allow me to have a little bit more range of motion as I dip down. Love it. Let's switch sides. Hope you are feeling good on this Friday, this fitness Friday. seconds on this side then we're going to do one minute on the other leg <sighs> keep going almost there three two one and let's switch legs stepping out make sure that your standing leg or I like to think of it as your anchor leg is straight throughout this whole exercise only one knee bends in this and that's the knee of the stepping leg is not getting into we're on the green on this one yes yeah it's not getting into the green you can add a little hop element in your balance yeah definitely and Ayla you are right where you should be you're at 77 percent okay yeah well into that green zone we're working our way toward yellow guys so you can start to maybe move a little bit faster in these last 20 seconds for the next exercise in the yellow zone, we will be standing, so we'll stay exactly where we are. Whew. Five seconds. Whew. All right, next exercise, it's two lunges. We're gonna be on one side at a time, so we'll step forward into a lunge, come halfway up, bring it down, step it back, and then go into a reverse lunge, halfway up, down, and forward, good. The addition of the half lunge from the bottom up, I really like. It's just feels yes. more challenging. It's a nice little pulse. Yes. And it really loads your base leg, Ooh. that back leg. Yeah. And then the front leg. <laughs> so as you guys can see, Ayla's doing a great job. And Ayla, if you can come a little bit more forward so you're yeah. in the frame. You bet. So they can see, perfect. So she's got this where she's bringing her leg up for balance. 
You could always do the lunge forward with your pulse, bring your feet together to rebalance yourself, and then go back. So lots of options to make it work for you. We are aiming for yellow zone right now, so you can move a little bit faster if you need to get there. Ah. Ayla's there, looking good. Keep going. Let's switch legs, switch legs. We have. I was burning. <sighs> yeah, you can definitely feel your thighs on this exercise, especially with the pulse. Yeah, it's no joke. 30 more seconds, then we're going into red. This will only be one minute red. Whew. Can you guys guess what the red zone exercise is gonna be? It's one exercise. Woo! You've seen us do them before. 15 seconds. Keep going, keep breathing. 10 seconds. Finish strong. Into Woo! the red. Oh boy. Next exercise is squat jumps. Right now, let's do it. Red zone is the goal. Down and up. So, so many options with this. You can do a hop each time you squat. You can do a hop with every other squat. You could do side hops, right? So many different ways. A little pivot. Woo. But regardless, my quads are killing me. Yeah, I'm loaded, oh. baby. Ah. Keep going, guys. You've got 30 seconds left. Halfway through. This will be the most challenging part of this workout, but we're almost done. We hit a peak, and then we come back down the roller coaster. Oh boy, 15 seconds. Make sure that you're breathing. Woo. Last five. And we're going back into our forward and back lunges with that pulse, oh boy. Here we go. Yahoo! Woo. This is a sweaty one, friends. Yes, most definitely. It's kind of making me regret a really heavy leg day <laughs> that I did just a couple days ago. Whew. My legs are jelly. Yes. And that's a good point in terms of you'll want to select your workout and your exercises in a way that's balanced and organized given what you've done previously. If you had a heavy leg day the day before, <laughs> this might not be the right one to do. <laughs> Woo, it burns. 20 more seconds on this leg. We're coming down the roller coaster. Next up, we'll do the other side, then we'll do green. Wee -hoo. We switch in five, four, three, two, switch legs. All right, you guys. Hope you're feeling good out there. Hope you're earning all the meps you can on this zone match. Remember, your goal is to be in the target zone which is yellow. Oh boy. Keep fighting through, guys. We're fighting through it with you. Whew. And we're gonna be in green next, correct, Em? Yep, green next. So you might wanna start mellowing out a little bit if you are in the upper yellow, so that you can be in green. Good point. The yellow or the green exercise, the green exercise will be those side lunge with the rotation to the balance. Keep it up, last 12 seconds. Oh, the burn is real. Oh yeah, almost there. And going into that side lunge with the rotation, take it down and up to balance. Remember, the rotation is optional. You can push off of your stepping leg with as much force as you need. More force equals more of a balanced challenge. You, Ayla, your heart rate's coming down toward good. green. Very good. We've got one minute on this side, one minute on the other side, and we're gonna hit the mat for some blue zone exercises. What you probably noticed is that as you come up to balance, the more that you engage through your core, the better balance you're gonna have, locked in nice and tight through your midsection. <sighs> 
we're almost about to switch. Keep breathing, guys. You're doing great. And let's switch sides. Moving in the other direction. Remember, you've got one straight leg. That's your anchor leg back home to standing. You've got your opposite knee is bending. You are rotating toward the side of that stepping leg. About 40 more seconds. I really like this exercise because it's working multiple planes of motion. Yeah. We have both frontal plane, which is side to side, and transverse, which is rotational. And this push off is actually like an anti-rotational movement, mm -hmm. which is great. Woo. 25 seconds left. Get ready to hit the floor for our last couple exercises. It's only two minutes in blue, then we're done. Well, we are. You keep going at home. <laughs> you keep riding the roller coaster. <laughs> do as we say, not as we do, guys. Come on. <laughs> Just kidding. Woo. Four, three, two, and one. Let's do our side planks to start. Brilliant. 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other. Oh yeah. Squeeze your glutes. Pull your belly button in toward your spine. Really trying to lift our hips. It's almost like you have a string going down through your hip. You're trying to pull it up. Whew. Letting it come down and then pull it up. Whew. Ayla, how much time we have left on this side? We should switch. Okay, let's do it. 24 seconds left. Whew. I mean a minute and 24. Cool. So in about 20 seconds, we'll go into our single leg hip bridges to finish this workout, or at least the portion of this workout. If you guys want to go through this, have a little bit more of a total workout, then you have one and a half more rounds to go. And one minute left of blue. All right, let's come down on our back. We're going into our single leg bridge. Squeeze your glutes, press your hips up and lower them down with control. This should feel pretty good after we just did yeah. those squat jumps and those insane pulses. Woo. Almost there. Switch. Last 30 seconds. Finish it strong, friends. You've got this. We're waiting for that amazing beeping sound that'll tell us when we've got five seconds left. Here we go. going if you're at home you're continuing to ride the roller coaster ah. the wrong button there friends. oh here we are <laughs> cool so good job you guys thank you so much for joining us Ayla yeah. was following along on her app you want to tell us what you got yeah so I earned 88 meps and uh, the good point on that one is that last week when we were doing I can't remember what we were doing the annihilator Something, something something intense something very <laughs> intense which at the end when I was looking at my report on the zone match report I was looking at calories burned and said that I earned 112 yeah. meps which would have been literally impossible in the 11 it's a the quick blast yeah in the 11 minutes of the quick blast the most that you can earn would be 44 points but the profile is set up to earn 37 points yeah and remember the whole point of zone match is to stay in the prescribed zones yeah. and earn the set number of my zone effort points. So make sure that you're looking at the right numbers when you're taking a look at the end, you're gonna see a report pop up. The little fire icon is of course the calories that you've burned. And then the circle with the little heart rate, heart rate blip is the number of my zone effort points that you've earned. Yeah, and I think that's a really great differentiating point is that, yeah. so Ayla, you did a warm up before this, right? Yep. So yep. you're 88 at the time, but now 91 meps are from the warm up and from what we just did exactly. together. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So, so if you're working out before or afterwards, yeah. then you're gonna need to take into account the MEPs that you've earned before or after the zone match workout. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but you know what's so great about that? This morning I knew, I was like, I wanna get 100 MEPs during my workout, but I really wasn't feeling it this morning. Yep. So I knew when we were gonna do this, I was gonna earn a certain amount of MEPs. Exactly. So I was able to kind of budget my time and my energy appropriately yeah. throughout the workout. Yeah, and that, that's so great if you have, and, and I hope that you do, have specific my zone effort points goals for yeah. each workout and for the week and for the month we've talked a lot about that in the past and this is a great way to involve your social connections and your friends on my zone the my zone community challenge people hey this workout i'm gonna earn x number of meps try to match me mm -hmm. or hey for this month i'm going for this number of meps or start a challenge because that's yeah. a nice way that you can play with your friends. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. We so appreciate it. Make sure that you are coming back every Friday at 8 a.m. Pacific time, 11 a.m. Eastern time, and get ready to work out with us. These workouts yes. include either no equipment other than your MyZone belt or minimal equipment. So you can do this right. at home, at the gym, wherever you are. Yeah, make it your own. Yeah. Hi, Steven. Thanks so much, you guys, for joining us. And Matt, too. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. All right. Bye. We will see you next week. And As always. Keep, Keep moving, moving forward. forward. Bye. Have a great weekend, everybody. Yeah.